Hello everyone, my name is Andrew Gillis. I'm the sports editor for The Post. I'm standing alongside Ohio punter Michael Farkas. He's a redshirt sophomore and he's one of the best punters in the MAC. So today he's going to teach me how to punt. He's going to teach uh, He's going to teach everybody else how he does his punts. Michael, how are you doing today? Doing well, how about yourself? <sighs> I'm a little nervous, but I think I'm all right. <laughs> um, so most people when they see punting, you just see, oh, you catch the ball, you kick it as far as you can, that's the end of the punt. There's a lot more finesse and a lot more nuances that go into the punting position and the punt than most people realize. So today, Michael's gonna teach me some of his punts. We're gonna, he's gonna teach me four, uh, and we're gonna see how that goes. So you ready? I'm ready, let's do it. All right, let's do it. So first, Michael's gonna teach me how to do a normal punt, just your standard, typical punt. So Michael, take it away. For my normal punt, I uh, kind of grip a little below, leave this top right panel open. Uh, drop it a little outside my quad and just try to get it to drop just like that a little nose back half spin Now it's my turn oh. <laughs> For my other one the one that gets out at the corner um, I drop it just like my rugby kind of get a little tilt back and then if you connect properly how you want it, it kind of goes up slow and kind of drifts a little bit and then kicks out. Yeah, like when do you use that side punt? When is that called? We're doing that inside the 50. Um, it depends on the returner. Uh, what we usually do is the normal pooch, but when we're inside the 50 and in between that and the 40, that's when we usually work with that one. Um, like I said, we do that and the backspin. Uh, it's kind of, it's all coach's decision, whatever he wants to do. Michael's gonna try to hit it in the corner of the end zone, or the corner of the field rather, Ow. get it inside the 10 yard line, pin the other team deep, uh, make sure there's no return on it. Michael, see how you do it. That's nice. So I'm gonna try the coffin corner now. It'll probably end up with me in a coffin, but let's see how it works. Oh, there it is. Backspin. Let me see that. All right, all right, okay. It's fairly okay. respectful. Um, so my third one, like I said, my favorite one, is uh, just the normal backspin. Get it to stop on the one, or have, say, Kylan standing here catching it. It's my, yeah, personal favorite. So, so how this, I- This one's inside the 52, right? Oh yeah, yep. So, and do these punts, do you, do you call these numbers, or is this, a, is this a design set, or how does that work? Um, usually Coach Hans and Coach Solich say, hey, I want to do this but sometimes they're like, in this wind, hey, whatever you're comfortable with, get as close to the goal line as you can, you know? So, um, like I said, how it was going is, I just drop it a little tiny back and just let it fall. Try to connect just about like right here with it. You do not want to hit the bottom. Oh, your foot is well, feeling what, that after. So what happens if you hit the bottom? Your foot feels it, but what else? Um, what, it's what, shorter. Do, what does it do to the punt? It, it does not go as high and as far. All right, so this one's the pooch punt. Michael's gonna put some backspin on it. I'm not going to, but we'll see. Catching <laughs> it, and I'm shuffling. I don't even know anymore. Keep going. You're inside the 20, and then rugby. I'm catching it, and I'm shuffling. And I'm holding it just like this, but just a little rotated. And I'm hitting about right here on the ball. So that's like a third of the way down. Yep. Yep. Like, right? yep. We did that against Tennessee last year. Camara mm -hmm. um, was the returner and you know, very good player. Um, they did not want him to return anything. So luckily, I think he only had 10 return yards last year. Inside the 20. 